Dr. Dana Suskin's speciality is surgery, putting cochlear implants in the ears of hearing impaired children. She had long noted big differences in how quickly they adapted to the changes. <laughs> But after implantation, I would notice significant differences in their vocabulary development, their ability to talk, to read, and that difference almost always fell along socioeconomic lines. That led Dr. Suskind to research how big socioeconomic disparities affect the amount parents talked to their children. Research that showed that by their fourth birthday, children born in affluent families had heard 30 million more words than children born in low-income families. Suskin founded the 30 Million Word Initiative, which aims to narrow that word gap by helping low-income parents engage in crucial conversation with their infants. According to her, babies aren't born smart, they're made smart by parents talking and interacting with them. 30 Million Words visits homes and shows parents how to effectively build word power through conversation. So by tuning into what he's doing and talking about it as he's doing it, then it's growing those connections in the brain right away. Videos show parents how, instead of just doing everyday tasks in silence, they can talk their baby through them. Another tool has helped produce data-driven graphs. It's a compact digital recorder tucked into a specially made vest and records hours of parent-child interaction. The graphs show parents how real-world results stack up against conversation goals they've set. The software will tell us how many words the child was exposed to, how many conversations, how much television. And really that's a concrete way that a parent can start understanding what type of language environment they're giving their child. Really sense, which is awesome. Sammy Doshi thinks conversations he's had with Blake, guided by the 30 million words philosophy, have made a huge difference. There's wheels are yellow. Look, take orange. He actually talks a lot more than all a lot of my younger cousins did, and it's amazing how it actually works. With the best the brain development conversations are two-way. The most important is the interaction right. between Sammy and Blake. Now I have friends that I've told and they took it and they ran with it and now they kids are talking and saying their ABCs and stuff. <laughs> it predicted things like differences in not only vocabulary development but how, they, how well they did in school in third grade, their IQs. Even back and forth sound effects can prepare babies for conversation, language development and classroom success. Toddlers in the 30 Million Words initiative are too young for school, but Dr. Suskind believes the enriched language experiences the programs provide will bear fruit in the classroom.